Okay, I think we should be fine. Let's get all this up. But yeah, we are back. Sorry about the delay with that. But hopefully things will be better now. We're gonna get this going. Since we already finished Agent Under Fire, we're gonna go directly to Night Fire. So I think that should be everything. Yeah, I think it should be. Okay. Double check some stuff here quickly first. Okay, well we can let that play at least. Get an idea of what we're looking at here. Hmm. Okay, so we still got the glasses. And take care of the body. Hmm. All right, two wheelie. Let's see how the driving sequences are this time. I wonder if they're going to be open. Maybe have some open sequences like we had in Agent Under Fire, or they're gonna be straightforward. Alright, James. Let's do this. Now, I haven't played the console version of Nightfire. I have only played the PC one, but that was years ago, and I barely remember it. So this is going to be first time running through this. So we start in Paris, this is New Year's Eve. Five minutes to midnight. Not something we really have right now, Q. Get me closer to the road. All right, so pretty much tutorial mode. Very well. Hi, Mr. Bongo. How are you doing? And I'm assuming you made it back safely, right? Because I know you said the last time we talked, you were getting a flight home, I believe, right? Or is that too long ago and I have lost track of time? I'm home. Be glad to be home. Also, is everything looking and sounding good? It was Saturday. Okay, so it was a few days ago. Well. That's one way to shoot up a good car. Can I offer you a lift? Uh, if you could, ma'am, please. And it sounds good too? Yeah, if you're noticing any issues, let me know. But thanks for that heads up, dude.
Of course we got the Aston Martin. That's one way to get between things. I mean, you gotta you gotta stick that line in there somewhere, right? Helps if we can drive effectively, right? But no, what are you up to tonight, dude? Any special plans? There we go. Well, that was convenient. You could say. Also, at least in the case of this, Happy New Year. Happy New Year, Jams. Happy New Year indeed. Dominique. I guess that's one way to ring in the new year, right? Now, I do remember this when I played the PC version, so I did like this intro. Still a good intro. I like this. Welcome to Night Fire. One immediate change I at least see with Night Fire is that they actually use Pierce Brosnan's at least as as him as a model which is nice hey siege what's up i mean i have to Bot is booing me again. Hey. It just has its moments, right? Fire manual land. Let's go with these controls. Yes, we're going to turn that on. I'm okay. Yeah, there's a trailer for Die Another Day. We're not going to watch that, though. But yeah, hopefully all sounds are good. We should hopefully be good for this, right?
Kasumi references from DOE 5 last round for drawing purposes. I saw you were posting quite a bit of it on there. So let's do this, shall we? Have any of you guys played Nightfire, out of curiosity? There is 007 on N64. There were actually a few on N64. There was Goldeneye, there was Tomorrow Never Dies, and The World Is Not Enough. Yeah, I was gonna say, you're probably meaning Goldeneye, right? I'd be curious to see what Tomorrow Never Dies, about Tomorrow Never Dies, and The World Is Not Enough. What those were. Hey, Glenn. How is it going? All right, so we're in. Yes, Pierce Brosnan as 007. At least they have his likeness. I don't think they use his voice for this game, though. I miss Pierce's 007. Which one was your favorite Pierce Brosnan movie? You would say. Same for everyone in chat. Like, what's your favorite Pierce Brosnan James Bond movie? For me, it's it's a toss-up between either GoldenEye or Tomorrow Never Dies. Because I have I recently saw GoldenEye for the first time. I never saw it before. My first James Bond, first experience with James Bond, at least in terms of films, was Tomorrow Never Dies. Yes, Michelle Yeoh was in it. I thought that was a surprise. And I know another movie I saw her in that I enjoyed was also with Chow Yun-Fat and Zhang Ziyi, Crouching Tiger, Hidden Dragon. Anyone seen that movie or remember that film? I haven't seen that movie in a long time. I wonder if it still holds up. Selfie approach. Oh well.
But no, Glenn, you got any plans tonight? Same with you, Siege. Any special plans for you? Pada, how's it going? Clone Wars. I haven't seen that. I need to. I've heard it's supposed to be good. But yeah, Pada, how was your stream? I saw you were streaming earlier. Nice. Shading techniques, so I'll post results in the Discord. Yeah, I'd be curious to see what your results are. I've been trying to follow your stuff on Instagram as well for what you're doing. Which, again, good stuff. League games with RNG. Stream was good. Announced redoing the merch store. Yes, I... I, tr I think I saw some of that on your archive as well, too. And you also posted to Twitter, on your Twitter feed, that 20% of proceeds, you're, put, you're going to be putting 20% of proceeds to a charitable, a charitable donation, right? Oh, I see your gun. I did a Connery Down Below 7 Marathon. I only have half of his movies. I only have half of his movies. I need to get the other half. Well, what's your favorite one out of those? And then, yeah, you said 20% of proceeds go to Defenders of Wild... There we go. Thank you, RNG. I appreciate that, man. How are you doing? Well, what would happen if I did the wrong one? Is you only live twice. No clue now. It's just like, ow, my head. <laughs> that seemed very anticlimactic. Looked like a spider bit on his neck. A bit, it just... That seemed kind of underwhelming. <laughs> but obviously From Russia, it's a, sir, it's a critic's favorite. Yeah, I saw From Russia, I really liked it. I I want to watch it again, and I actually have, like Doctor No. But you can definitely tell that was their first attempt, their first attempt at like nailing the formula and everything, right? Here we go. Also, RNG, Pat, I wish you both luck on your on your league run. Double O seven. The guests won't take kindly to firearms. 
Keep them hidden to maintain a low profile. Fine. No shooting people. Sure look. Sure look. I'm waiting for someone. I see that. No, I can't talk to them. Hi there. Well, hello. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Thank you for the Lord Pat, I appreciate it. Yes, okay. Not now. Hello? A lovely Yes, you could say that. Bond being trained as a ninja. Is that the one, like the one you were just talking about? Okay, here we go. Thank you all for accepting my invitation this evening. Your generous gifts have ensured the success of our World Refugee Fund. At the Once undercover again, agent. My gratitude to all for making the journey here. And now, cocktails are waiting for you in the salon. Okay. I have business to attend to. Play the hostess, won't you, darling? I should try and get my hands on that. No party guests in here, sir. James. Hmm. Oh, deep cover, Agent. It's not as deep as it looks. Oh, I'm sure it goes much deeper with her. Sorry to interrupt your debriefing, 007. Wow, I know. Hikers Dragon! CIA. Dominique Paradis, French intelligence. I am. Um, I, I like Dominique. <laughs> With the stolen guidance device. I'll say that right now. I'm all right, dude. How are you doing, though? I have business to attend. Yeah, of course. Totally not sketch. But this is her business. Am I six? Want surveillance photos of that exchange? Right. I'll create a distraction for you while you make your way to the. Is that a bug? Is that dress standard company issue, Nachi? Don't get any ideas, Double Sam. It's all in all the right places. I would hope so. Bond, don't let Drake's men get in your way. Use whatever means necessary to get to that meeting. I mean, it makes sense, right? I wouldn't say this pierces the 007 pierce. Is just a such a sucker. I mean, couldn't you say that about all the Bonds in general? Or did they just really emphasize it during his era? Well, that worked. It's 
It's actually a pretty satisfying headshot sound. I will say that. Okay, so that must be the end. Very satisfying indeed, 007. Maybe in more ways than one. But no, Cursed Dragon, what are you up to tonight, though? Any special plans? Here it is, Mr. Drake. The missile guidance module we stole from the Americans. I trust this effort brings us one step closer to... Hey, it's that girl we saw earlier. You've saved our technicians considerable time, Mayhew. Can we accelerate the other Nightfire elements as well? Absolutely, sir. We're well underway training assault teams for the... Get your hands off me! The cotton's a hallway, sir. I was looking for the powder room. It's lockpicks and the 9mm? Hey, it's a tough neighborhood. <laughs> if this security breach leads back to Japan, it's your head, Mayhew. Secure this in the safe room. I doubt she's alone. Lock the castle down. Now! I was going to say, your suit is slipping through the table. I don't want her interrogation to upset the guests. Interrogation? What kind of party is this anyway? Well, we're gonna have to save her. I can switch to that pistol. I do need an ammo box. I, I mean, uh, armor suit. Thank you, Heroic. To Sean Connery. No, no, no. I mean, if you want to do one for Pierce Brosnan, nothing lasts forever. Pierce could probably still pull it off for sure. How you doing though, Heroic? The Moon of the Psyche is nice, got all the services. 
Thank you. We got armor there, so. I wonder if we can open this. Yep. Now we need to get Zoe. Excuse me, gentlemen. That's good to hear, man. What are you up to tonight, though? That's Barbara Broccoli. <laughs> Probably wouldn't. I mean, aren't they picky with the license? Oh, of course. There we go. Hey, Leafer, how's it going? I'd probably be like the nerdy 007. Hang on to me, Zoe. I thought you'd never ask. Ah, oh, jeez. <laughs> really? But the world needs you too, Glenn. Nice landing, James. Why do you always seem to end up on top? Center of gravity? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't know about that, James. Man, the one liners, right? Next mission. Can we just see Dominique again? I mean, I'd rather I'd rather be with a that woman, even though Zoe is... It's nice to see her come back. That one's a nasty bit of business, isn't it? Perfect. You drive, I'll shoot. Also, how did you fit that? You drive, I'll shoot. I knew he was going to say that, too. Hurry, Zoe. We haven't much time.
Okay, there we go. Talk about timing, right? We're definitely cool, right? I mean, I say so. Why we wouldn't? Why are we not? Gonna continue binge watching Clone Wars. Well, Glenn, I'll be here for a while, so take your time, man. But I hope you enjoy Clone Wars. I still need to see that show. Behind us, James. Wow, look at that guy fly. Hi, Hawk. How's it going? Wait, why did you just randomly stop? I was playing a game with my cousin. Doing alright now. What were you playing? Parents are arguing, yelling, and blah. Yeah, no, I hate that shit too. It's just uncomfortable. There we go. Oh, John, salt and sacrifice is weird. How so? Play some, we can't. Yeah, I'd be down if you want to play some more, say, KOFO2 or something. Or Garo. That is really weird. They mix 2D Castlevania with Souls with Monster Hunter. Yeah. No, I've been reading a few impressions of Salt and Sacrifice. That's what I have been hearing about it. And, like, it's an interesting change. Mix the two. I mean, I'd be down. Yeah, just drive right through the thing. Looks like we're on foot from here. Where exactly is here, James? Not far from my rendezvous point. Hold on. Okay. So here we go. Smaller levels, still has a sort of normalish progression. Mage bosses that you defeat and use materials and then craft weapons. Yeah. So I remember reading something in the preview about oh in the impressions about mages. That almost sounds like something in 
almost gives you a bit of vibes of ukulele in the impossible layer but also like smaller levels is it is there like a hub world hawk is it like a hub world so it almost sounds akin to like say demon souls Shave, yep. You're the first person to say something about it, Ren. How are you doing, hon? Okay. Not too bad. Baby face. Sorry, you got in my way. But you know, haircut and a shave. Jeez, really traffic. Please, the facial hair, it seems foreign to me. Would you say the same thing with short hair too? Yeah, we need to go this way. To be honest, I didn't notice that. Yeah, no, that's fair. But no, it's more like the beard and stuff that makes the big difference, you'd say, right? So forgive my piss poor driving everybody but no how fa how far in you would say are you into the game hawk Don't mind me. Yes, we have all the big names here too, so. Well, I mean, at least I would say between all of my friends here, you're all, you're all big names. We're all big. I'd say popular. Unless you're trying to prove me, unless you want to prove me wrong there. I did see something that you put out a new drawing. I haven't had a chance to take a look at it yet, though, Hawk. All right, let's keep going with this new drawing. Okay. Warned, MI6 has been contacted by Alexander Mayhew. 
Raphael Drake's chief Bayesian operations. Mayhew fears uh, that Drake intends to hmm. holding him responsible for their little setback in Austria. Little steamy? In for our Maybe. Mayhew will deliver evidence exposing Drake's master plan, the codename Nightfire. The scheme that Mayhew insists threatens global security. The name's Bond. James, James Bond. Bond. It's not James Bond, Mayhew it's Bond. John McBond. Mayhew has one demand. To be brought in by James Bond himself. Our informant awaits you at his Japanese estate. Good luck, 007. Jeez, okay, butt shot. Okay, take care. Take care, Leaper. We'll be here for a while, so take your time. Oh, it's her again. Ah, oh, jeez. Ah, Mr. Bond, at last. This is Kiko Hayashi, my bodyguard. I assure you, she's quite skilled. No doubt. Yes. <laughs> the nightfire data may be wrong. We weren't expecting other guests. Please, stay with Alex. It's Drake. Quick, we must get to the security bunker. Hang on, I need to pick up the ammo. I'm not going anywhere till you check the hallway. But no, Ren, are you up to anything tonight? It's too spicy. Well, maybe just a little, but I'm okay. I'm not dead yet. I haven't suffered from a heart attack. I gave John nosebleeds. Wasn't anything from the Not Safe for Work account. Now I'm even scared to see what that is. Open the door. Come on. Let's go. Well, that shotgun takes up a lot of space on the screen when he has to pump it, I just noticed. Should I be scared? We're close to the bunker now. <laughs> yeah. So far, nothing bad has happened. What you're yet. looking for is locked in my bedroom safe. This is the key. Just feed it to the dragon. The dragon? Right. Keep your head down. I'll be back for you. Also, could you wipe the hard drive on my computer? I don't want to leave a data be trail rising. to follow. Are you allowed to talk about it? My servants? They're like family to me. Are you allowed to talk about it, Ren? Like, what exactly is the game? What is it about? If I can't ask those questions. NDA, sadly. Okay. So, no. I won't ask, Then I won't ask any more questions with it, but... We have a name, V Rising. I'll have to take a look into it though. Uh, no, okay. Just 
Come on, auto aim. You saved my life. How would I repay you? If I live through this, I'll need a large sake and one hell of a massage. Ah, oh, jeez. <laughs> you know, as pretty as you are, I mean, I would, I would, I would appreciate that too. But look, we got a job to do, James. We don't have time for this. Okay. <laughs> but with vamp. With vampires. Okay. I'm listening. You have me intrigued. Now I know you can't go into too much. As long as you're enjoying it, sounds like you're having fun with it so far. Wow, that shotgun worked well. And you burn in the sun, so. Makes sense. Really? You're you're just gonna eat that. Oh, okay, shoot the thing. I thought I needed to press a button or something. Dang. It's okay, you're safe. I think. Well, so far so good, right? Although I am not a fan of our health situation. Yeah, don't shoot the hostages, please. I actually never got to play Valheim originally. The game looked like a lot of fun, though. And I know that game kind of blew up in popularity.
There we go. One way to shit drop in. We're looking for a dragon statue now. So I missed someone here. Oh, I think I know where. I didn't go into that. Okay, we gotta look for something though. I hear a pet collar rattling. Yep, it's doggos. They're hanging out here. Gotta be somewhere. Hi, helpless. Long time no see. What is up? Been alright. You know, trying to stay sane. Busy with work. With work, among other things. You know how it is. How has school been for you? Ooh. Are you... Yes. Just what I need. It's a ghost. I'm officially done school for the semester until fall. So now you got free time. Nice. Hopefully things went well for you in the semester, right? I am trying to find something. When is it not stressful, right? Need to make sure I'm doing this right. Yeah, dragon safe contents. That'll be exciting. Oh, there it is, there it is, there it is. Okay, now we can get out of here. But no, what are you up to tonight? Anything special going on? This section's now done. 
Ah. Let's keep moving. We're finished here, Mayhew. Let's go. What about Kiko? Have you seen her? She's a big girl. I'm sure she can take care of herself. Yeah. Ah, uh, crap. We got a problem. Wait here. Let's get moving. Yep. I told you to stay there. There we go. Doing my nails. I guess you gotta keep them maintained, right? Yeah, I know. I, I actually cut mine a couple days ago. The code key you found in my safe will lead you to the Nightfire Evidence, the Phoenix building in Tokyo. Tokyo? You'll need the password to the mainframe. It's Afterburn. I thought the evidence was here, Mayhew. I did a little extra insurance policy to keep me alive. A lot mm -hmm. of good it did me have. Shit, he's gone. I was pinned down. Alex. I promise you, Drake will pay. Kiko, you're not safe here. Come with me. Come on, we gotta go. Thank you for that lurk medal, I appreciate it, dude. I hope you're doing all right. Alex's code key and password should get you into the Phoenix mainframe, but they'll have the whole building locked down by now. Anything can be penetrated with the proper tool. Of course. How did I know you were going to go that route? so has Q branch. You will find several useful items have been added to your inventory. Tranquilizer darts for inconveniently placed guards, silent and non-lethal. What we're gonna need. Helpless, do you have any history with James Bond? And finally, the Q worm. Q? There's a lady present. Plug this virus into one of the computer terminals and the worm allows MI6 to monitor their systems. Please try to return these tools in usable condition. But I shan't hold my breath. No. Q out. James, you need to hurry. The guards change shifts in 30 minutes. Alright, I guess we're gonna have to be quick when it comes to this, right? Let's see how this goes. Okay, so now I have to go this way. Okay. Yeah, let me press that button. Okay. Let's see how well this shit goes.
Are you... S There's stairs here? Shit. Okay, never mind. No, I think we need to get in there. Office floor laser trip switches test cycle now running. Cycle will complete in four minutes. Laser trip switches test cycle aborted. Office floor laser system. many of the films. Which one's your favorite, you'd say? I'm kind of curious to see now, since, well, Daniel Craig is now done with the films, right? No Time to Die was his last one. Well, because I think Amazon has all of them now, if I'm right. Raise the alarm. Office floor laser trip switches test cycle now running. Cycle will complete in. Four minutes. Laser trip switches test cycle aborted. Office floor laser system now active. Office floor laser trip switches test cycle now running. Cycle will complete in four minutes. Female 007 or Riot. Well, if you want to have a female 007, who should fit that role? Like, that would be one option. Another one, for, for me, I want to color 007. I think that would be pretty badass. A new up and coming I think that would be cool. Cycle will complete in three minutes. Idris Elba or Bust Baby. Wasn't he a contender, I think? Oh, hi, but
cycle will complete in two minutes. I think fans want it. I mean, it would be nice for the fans. Laser trip switches test cycle aborted. Office floor laser system now active. Executive floor lasers test cycle now running. Again, apologies if not too talkative. Just trying to focus. Cycle will complete in three minutes. Okay, I'm not very talkative either tonight. Don't worry. Oh, shit. You take a nap. Crap, I pull out the wrong thing. I mean, that would be pretty cool. We haven't seen too much on that. Laser trip switches test cycle aborted. Executive floor laser system now active. Yeah, don't kill people. It happens though. I want to see more on Sea of Stars though. That's what I'm excited for. Laser trip switches test cycle aborted. Office floor laser system now active. Executive floor lasers test cycle now running. Although, I do need to see, what is it, I need to see the Sonic, the Sonic 2, because I know Idris Elba plays Knuckles, and I want to see how well that turns out. Wait, what are the objectives? will complete in three minutes. 
Where's the office computer systems, though? There we go. Cycle will complete in two minutes. Now I can go back the way I came for this, right? Just before it went off. Dominique? What is she doing here? Thank you. That was just convenient. But you know what? It's fine. We're just here to kind of hang out and just watch me try to be a secret agent, right? Oh, I gotta wait for it to come back down. Shit. Okay, fine. Don't fall off, James. Make sure objectives. Okay, we're in. Okay, so not this way.
So has this mission now just basically gone to shit? Yep. Come on. Okay. You must get out of here, Tim. It's a trap. I put that together when your boyfriend's chopper nearly clipped me off the building. You don't mm -hmm. understand. Drake couldn't help and make you safe without the password, and he's not going to let the night fireflies live with you. These stairs go directly to the roof. You'll find a parachute in the helicopter. It's your only chance of escape. Dominique, if Drake finds you out... Do you think you're the only spy you can make someone trust you completely? Ah, uh, yes, yeah. You know, I like Dominique, but come on, James. Please, James, go now. Why did the rocket go that way? Of all places. Damn it. Oh well, let's try this again. We know what we have to do though. So this shouldn't be too difficult now. Okay, I'm on. will complete in 10 seconds.
They just do a number. Jeez. So this might take a couple minutes. Cycle will complete in ten seconds. Yeah, those do a lot of damage. He took him out, though. Okay. Okay, so that's that was the end of the mission at least, so Come on, girls, why you gotta be like that? Welcome back, Glenn. How goes the marathon? From Clone Wars, oh yeah? We're slowly making progress. They contain rather troubling data concerning a shutdown nuclear power plant not far from Tokyo. Phoenix Corporation has been contracted to cleanse the plant of radioactive material. We now suspect that massive amounts of construction have been Did you finish the first season? Inside the towers. Or you still got a few more episodes to go. And find out what Drake is hiding. As always, 007. Best of luck. Give me your gun. We're just going to need I'm just going to need to do some sniping. Of course, dismantling a nuclear reactor is an incredibly delicate operation. And dangerous as well, yes. That is why we've invested in robot technology. Like those forklifts, insanely expensive. But I don't remember the names off the top of my head, but the whole Spectre organization, at least in From Russia with Love, that was a big one. Also, the villain in Tomorrow Never Dies. And so do I. Interview is over, Mr. Rook. All snipers back in position.
Okay. He's still alive. I guess that chopper... That chopper explosion didn't do much. Oh no, I see you now. I've lost him. Intruder spotted. Not shot. You just... Thank you. That could have gone better. Favorite 007 gadget. For me, it's always a grapple. The grapple, but also the glass. The glasses just ha that have X-ray vision, for obvious reasons. Take cover. What about you? You see me, but I don't see you. I see him. He's behind the shipping crates. Intruder spotted. I'm in. I see him. Oh, I see you. Or movie gadgets, or both. I would say at least for game gadgets. I didn't see where he was, unfortunately.
That's at least two there. Whoa, whoa, whoa. It's going so far. The Q Spider is actually pretty cool. Metal, how are you doing though? Good morning, Carla. How are you? We're doing okay. Just rocking out to some night fire. More than gold than I reloaded, actually. Well, everything or nothing is noted for being one of the best, if not the best, James Bond game. So, there is that. Just a waiting game at this moment to see what's going on, yeah. Sadly, that's what it's become now, right? Apparently, I've heard Legends even le leans into that a lot more. But yeah, we're just making it through right now. Intruder spotted. Bear down, bear down. I see him. Intruder spotted. Bear down, bear down. I see him. Just keep shooting people. That's normally the solution, right? Not Daniel Craig. I understand why they did it though. Just because Daniel Craig was the current is the current bond. Or was the current bond at that time, right? Carla, what are you up to this morning? Oh, I know how to get up there. Yeah, that was, I think, his only video game role, and that's one of his last roles he did. Right? It seemed entertaining. I just want to sleep though. Well, after that you should sleep. Carla needs her rest, right? In Apex? Nice. Oh shit. Almost fell off. That's at least a good sign. On the deep dark interwebs. Uh oh. 
Should I be happy or should I be scared about that boundless? Also, hello. How are you doing? No, I don't think so. The Living Daylights. That'd be an interesting one. It's just a matter of convincing him to do it. Actually, one James Bond game I do want to try that I have is Bloodstone. And air drops it on Carla. It has to be the way she likes it or else, right? Probably not the way you're supposed to do this, but I'm doing it. Reviews. Fair. Which way do we go? Oh no, wait, I think I need to kind of climb across that. Well, you gotta get to double O status, though, soon, though, Yuki. How are you doing? Mock speed bullets. Be like, what the hell? Yup. Things are flying, aren't they? There we go, there's our door. I mean, way to go with coffee, right? You could just FedEx it to her door, right? They're dead. Here, eat bullet. He's on the stand, I've lost him. I see him. He's behind the shipping crates. He's gone inside. What are you doing in here? Okay, go eat dinner, Metal. We'll be here for a while. No, Carl was more amazing than that. And we're good. I mean, that is a good idea. I see him. I've lost him. I see him. I'm 
Ari, hi, welcome back. How are you? Intruder spotted. I saw one. Intruder spotted. I'm it. I see him. I'm it. How are you doing? Well, Glenn votes I should be the next 007. What do you guys think? You think that should be a thing? He's on the stairs. I see you. Not anymore. Double O seven in training, we'll say that. I see you. There we go, that was close. Ah, shit. Well, that didn't do as much damage as I thought. That's still pretty bad. Not so unhappy told me, jeez. Adulting is difficult. Adulting is not easy. It sucks, but it's gotta be done, right? But no, Yuki, what are you up to tonight? Oh, now you're gonna let me go on it. Okay. Come on, James. I wouldn't mind actually seeing a gold, a 007 game where you make your own James Bond. I think that would be pretty dope. Until meds kick in. How many? Is it the ones you normally have to take? Yeah, you yeah, that's right, Ari. That happened. It needed to happen at some point, right? I need to restart this mission. I'm going to die.
Is it that shocking though? What is he doing? Oh, that would be an awesome thing to meet Daniel Craig. I knew it was going to happen at some point. Got to get the kids up. Going to be a long day. Go get that done. Hang on. You could say that, Yuki, I guess. I'll pick up the armor. Where is he? I've lost him. The John's camera until I looked at my battery percentage and I was like, wait, what? Just like, it's a dras- is it that drastic of a change? Or is it that shocking? I see him. Wait, there's one in here. That was terrible that it needed that much ammunition. Intruder spotted. Man down, man down. Hmm. I I haven't thought about that. Who could work? With the long Hair and facial hair. Nick Jonas. <laughs> I thought I would be better than maybe one of the Jonas Brothers, right? I would hope. Contact lost. I can't see him. I would hope. I see him. I wish I could see these I guys. See There's one. I don't know who I would want. There's there's names. I guess Jessica Alba would be one. Intruder spotted. Contact lost. I can't see him.
Hmm. What are some other good options though for Bond girls? Or at least somebody to fit the roles. Hmm. Now that just ruins the experience. <laughs> Intruder spotted. If only I knew where you were. Oh, I see you now. Who else could? I haven't been really following too much. Hang on. More snipers. I've lost them. I see you now. Man down. Man down. Man down. I see him. Intruder spotted. Man down. Man down. Ta -da, ta -da. I don't know. I'm open to suggestions for that. OGQ or the Neo Q. OGQ. Normally, but I mean, if I had a choice, I would also take John Cleese. He did a good job as a, I think he was R, right? <laughs> nah. But no, Ari, what are you up to tonight? Just hanging out? I need ammo for this thing. Thank you. Oh, there we go. Okay. I'm going to need to get across. Grapple. It can, yeah. The Audi R8. If you want, if you're picking car, that's my car. What the hell was he doing? Uh, that 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 uh, shit. Contact lost. I can't see him. I see him. I'm it. Come on. Hold on a sec. Am I just gonna have to make a run for it though?
Yeah, I think they're just gonna keep coming. Okay, so that was the end of the mission. Nice. Bond keeps it easy. Because you could say it's a play on Bond. Alright, James. Where are we going? Well, hello. Kiko, where have you been? Trying to catch up with you. Get with me. Come on. I almost thought she we lost her back in Japan. You must be exhausted, James. What would you say to a little nap? Of course. Alright, good night, Yuki. Thanks for hanging out with us, buddy. I don't think so. Well, she's not. Yeah, she's gone. Villain weapons count. I'm not sure actually, I never really thought about that in terms of weapons. Although I guess a good desert eagle would, would count. I don't know if a Bond villain's used it. She got in the way of my ball of my shotgun. Oh well. Making it through, we'll say that. Good morning. Good morning, Chameleon. How are you? How are you doing, sir? I'm not gonna kill you. Seven, three, four, five. We're doing all right, though. Or at least trying to live. Get in shape, took a shower, getting ready for work. What time is your shift? Super iconic. Which one?
You could say that, right? Oh, I could use that. But no, what time is your shift, though, Chameleon? Can someone make the pain go away? We can try, but... What kind of pain? Is it body aches? Yes. We got a full day? What would you say is your pick though, Glenn? The golden gun. Isn't there multiple variations of the golden gun? I believe, right? But what is the best version of it, though? Hang on. 
Do they just keep coming? I think they just do. Which is a super cheap gun. And then there's the golden one here. Hang on, take cover. There we go. Yeah, no, it it's rough. Like, I know, like paint paint sucks, but sometimes you got to do what you got to do, right? No, I am not shooting that. I don't want to have to restart the mission. I know what you're thinking. But you forget I can counter it too. Mm-hmm. Save your points because that's more funny. I would say Italy. No, I need to watch more 007 stuff. I need to... I want to get more of the movies and everything. I need to get the other Sean Connery ones for sure. Yeah, no, that's completely fair. I gotta get in there somehow. A Venice and Moonraker. That's I haven't seen Moonraker. That's the one with Roger Moore, I believe. That's the code I'm looking for. Yeah, like At the end, you mean where you see the, you mean that, that fancy building, right? That guy's mansion? Because Quantum of Solace picks up, I think, right after, right from there, correct? Okay, I'll hydrate a bit. Thank you, Ari. I don't I've not seen any movies with Roger Moore, and I haven't seen the Timothy Dalton ones either. I think we're gonna have to take her down.
Come on, come on, come on, come on. There we go. This is going to be a problem. Okay, so that one's out of my control. Shinky, thank you for that, dude. Hang on, I'm being shot at. How was your stream, buddy? How was Star Ocean, the second story? And hello, Raiders. We're just rocking out to James Bond. So don't mind me. Yeah, I need that. I need that. There we go. But yeah. What? I gotta grind for the cast. Is there something you need to buy? Also, I'm sad because Dominique is dead. So I can get one of the best weapons for the main game. one is that? Sword of Marvels. Reload, reload, reload. Yeah, she is in a bit of hurt. You know what? I don't. I don't have time for your crap. I'm gonna leave. Thank you. Need a lift, Mr. Bond? A lure a call. Australian intelligence. Is there a such thing as Australian intelligence?
no. They would just welch off the bridge, jeez. Jeep, hey, welcome back. How's it going? Allura. It's my time of month. I told the others that medicine and heating pads don't work. It's been going okay, though, dude. You did well at Drake's training facility, 007. We agree that the rockets to launch these astronauts into space... Yeah, you could say that. Same here. Just doing good enough. Play with Bond. Million, enjoy your day at work. Don't work too hard. I'll talk with you soon, okay, buddy? Going to learn. All right, Carla. I understand. Hopefully your day goes well, though. Yeah, we're driving. Just watch. Ignore that sinking feeling, Agent McCall. Everything is under control. Is it under control? You need to infiltrate Drake's Best if I could be a villain. Look for an entry point and stay clear the the Russian agent in from Russia with love. And they only have a title, yeah. I'm, I would be glad to see. What the? Okay. You need to infiltrate Drake's Island undetected. Look for an entry point and stay clear of patrols. Okay. So don't shoot anything. Don't let them spot us. Sever their communications network, 007. That will allow you to engage the enemy without raising a general alarm. Indeed, I remind you that stealth is your best approach. Okay, so don't shoot it then again. I thought I could destroy that. Guess not. Alright, fine. Fine, all Ari, I'm gonna try. But no, Shinky. Good to hear from you, though. How long is actually the second Star Ocean game, out of curiosity? We off any movie. I think that's the only thing I remember out of the article. Yeah, I I've heard it's supposed to be an origin story. Yeah, I know, but still. I believe this mission called for stealth, 007. So how do I get past that then? 007, you need to infiltrate Drake's Island undetected. Bloodstone, hell, it was my first online multiplayer game ever. I I have Bloodstone. But I haven't tried it. What did you play Bloodstone on? But also, again, hang on. <coughs> Sorry. The the guy from the world is not enough. That doesn't feel pain. Creators of the game. Yeah, when Microsoft, like, I hope they do. I was when I heard that Bizarre Creations got shut down from Activision. I was like, that that fucking blows. But they live on as playground games. Don't worry, Ari. 
I'm just trying to stay focused on the task at hand, so I apologize if I'm not too talkative either. No, I mean, the reason they did, they shut them down, is because Bloodstone did not do well, sales-wise and review-wise. Oh, okay. Better keep your distance, James. Those mines look nasty. You're telling me. You know what would suck if we have to do all this again, but I know it's going to happen. Yep. Then any FPS, because Bloodstone was a third person shooter, right? Because I know Legends was first person. Legends was basically another COD, it looked like. Just hit a mine, why don't we? Hey, I'm trying to avoid it! Unless you want to take the wheel here. Legends was terrible, and that's the one that kind of killed off the franchise for a while. Yep, that was that was inevitable. Because I, I was hoping to go through Bloodstone at some point. Maybe we'll do it later on just for shits and giggles. But I think if I was to play Bloodstone, I'd probably do the PC version. I did try out Quantum of Solace quickly on PC. That's not great. Are you f it landed on top of me. hundred percent achievements how tough is it for that game and are do you and you have to play multiplayer I guess to get some of those achievements too right
Well, how tough would it be for you to get a 360? This is going to take a while. That's all you need? Because I think I have Quantum of Solace, but I have it for PlayStation 3. I have GoldenEye Reloaded, though. I know that. For Xbox. So Mark can execute stuff? God fucking shit. If you're tired, Ari, you should go get some sleep. I don't remember it well. I know the game differs from the movie a bit. Because I saw the movie and I really liked the movie. We're going to find out because I when we get to it, because I haven't played it yet. It was PS2, Xbox, and GameCube. The only one I'm missing, at least from this era, is GoldenEye Rogue Agent. I don't have that one. I wish I could destroy that. That would make this so much easier. I know you can find copies of it on eBay. That's where I found most of the James Bond games, Glenn. I'd avoid it. Ignored its existence. Do not play Rogue Agent. Just skip it. Because I was going to, like when we were doing the sub goals, I was going to put Rogue Agent on the list. Ari, sleep is important. Looks like there's another route around, so. 007. You need to infiltrate Drake's Island undetected. Look for it's just not Bond to me. I think it was originally not supposed... What I remember watching and finding information on Rogue Agent, it wasn't supposed to be a GoldenEye name. They just threw the name on there.
sensors, 007, and try the V12 Vanquish's remote control torpedoes. Is there another route? It looked like there was. 007, you need to infiltrate Drake's Island undetected. Look yeah, if you want to actually see some info on it, Jeep, by Rare or EA, Rogue Agent was EA. Rare only worked on GoldenEye 007. That's it. Spot us. Sever their communications network, 007. That will allow you to engage the enemy without raising a general alarm. Your remote torpedoes aren't as powerful, 007, but they'll allow you to eliminate hard to reach targets. Oh, you will. One of these days. Okay, so there was a secret route. Good night, Ari. Take care of yourself. Now, let's say if you want to see some info on Rogue Agent, I would go watch a video Racefic did recent did on Goldeneye Rogue Agent. It was a fascinating watch. The red makes it tough. <laughs> Nobody there, boy. Yeah, I got stuck. I didn't know where to go. Let's try this again. 007, you need to infiltrate Drake's Island undetected. Look for an entry point and stay clear of patrols. Welcome back. I'm just stuck on a mission right now, Hawk. So, un remain undetected. Hey, Pain Onyx. It's going, man. That V12 Vanquish is very expensive. Avoid those sensors, 007, and try the V12 Vanquish's remote. It's going, it's going, Pain Onyx. How are you doing? Better keep your distance, James. Those mines look nasty. That's, that's fine. We'll try it again. I'm really hoping that IO that IO does the series justice you need to since it's been idle for so long look for an entry point and stay clear of 
patrols. Again, I would hope we see something on it this year. I think it'd be cool if we do. GTA and RE5. RE5 is a good co-op game. Better keep your distance, James. Those mines look nasty. Are you fucking serious? Out a year early. Well, no, they did that intentionally. They did that intentionally. They wanted to be a, the first out of the gate. If Dalton could do that, that would be great. Would you want it to be an original James Bond game, though? Or would you want it to be based off of, like, one of the movies Dalton did? Your remote torpedoes aren't as powerful, 007, but they'll allow you to eliminate hard-to-reach targets. Sensors 007 and try the B 12 languages remote control torpedoes. Dalton was the worst Bond. Is that why? Better keep your distance, James. Is that why they he only had two movies? was a darker bond before Daniel Craig, before they went that route. Hold on, I gotta focus for a sec. Okay, so we go down. Are you f- Jeez. Really? But then when Craig's era came in, people were more, you could say, accepting or wanting. I thought it was all just like kind of one connected thing in a sense, though, Hawk. So it's just like Bond just goes through different missions. And it's just like a different iteration of them. Whereas Craig's, like, at least with Casino Royale, Casino Royale was a remake. There we go. Take now. He is so beloved. Yeah, I mean, I remember when Craig was announced. Keep your distance, James. Those mines look nasty. When Craig was announced, a lot of people, some people took umbrage with it. Because they weren't sure how to feel about it. Too fucking cheesy and ruined him as Bond. There's one thing I will say, at least with what I've seen so far of the Bond movies. I think Brosnan's had the worst last one. Like, Die Another Day was not that great.
that made his movies just suck for me. But then again, you could say, if you want to go, if you factor the games into play, you could say technically everything or nothing was Bo was Brosnan's last role as Bond. And everything or nothing was very good. There we go. That movie never happened, so the last Brosnan movie you would say is then The World Is Not Enough? But no, it was just like I was talking about it with, with someone earlier. Like, not on stream, but before. I think Die Another Day does have a few good sequences in it. But as a Bond movie, it is kind of, yeah, blah. God damn it. No, they did do a game adaptation of it. They, they put it in... They put it in Legends. Night. Everything or nothing should have been the movie, you think? Then play GoldenEye Remake back to back. You know what? If that GoldenEye, I still want that GoldenEye Remaster to be true. If that GoldenEye Remaster is true, then I would be happy to do. I would be happy to do that. It's the same thing like we did with Metal Gear Solid. Play the original Metal Gear Solid and then play the Twin Snakes. What the? F Yeah, I'd be like, nope, he got captured. 007, you need to infiltrate Drake's Island undetected. Look for an entry point and stay clear of patrols. Yeah, because that's not what you would expect from Bond, right? Like, there's always going to be a hiccup when it comes for him trying to escape, but... Just to have him straight up captured. Your remote torpedoes aren't as powerful, 007, but they'll allow you to eliminate hard to reach targets. That'll keep them from radioing ahead. Avoid those sensors, 007, and try the B 12 Vanquish's remote control torpedoes. Apply more layers and blend with a Q-tip. Jeez, Q-tips.
This sucks. The pen grenade. Uh, what was the other cool one? I did like, even though it's very unsafe, I did like in Tomorrow Never Dies where he drove his BMW from the back seat. I thought that was actually pretty cool. Like, that would be satisfying, wouldn't it? Those mines look nasty. Stop. I'm trying to avoid the mines, Q. Give me a break. Okay, see you in a few. Sub there we go. It might be a longer way into the base. All right, this is completely new, so gotta focus.
stay close to him, James. You have failed to infiltrate Drake's base, 007. I hit one no, thing and it screwed me up. Jeez. 007, you need to infiltrate Drake's island. Boo. Damn physics. And again, no mid-level checkpoints for this. Yep, you gotta restart everything. No, we're not uninstalling. I'm already this far in. We are not stopping. Is that what you would do, Hawk? Avoid those sensors, 007, and try the V12 Vanquish's remote control torpedoes. Well, I wonder how far we are in. I think it, I had like three or four missions left. Better keep your distance, James. Those mines look nasty. At least this, that part isn't as tough as I thought it would be. Cube charge online. Right, 007. Now get out of there. change bond happens we'll have to see what they do with it i mean it's too early to call right now right but i have faith that there will be a that it's in the right hands and i want to see like not only where the movies go but also where that game is going to who is the new bond going to be I still think it would be an interesting idea if you make a new James Bond where you can make your own Bond. You make your own 007 agent. But the one thing I'm curious about since IO's at the helm is that is it going to be more like Hitman? I hope it's not like the Hitman games. Yeah, that's the only thing I'm curious about. The only reason I say that is just because are they going to lean down that road or are they going to do like a hybrid? We can't allow Drake to keep nuclear subs. You must find a way to destroy them. Cube charge online.
two subs remaining. James, that sub is blocking our access to the beach. Okay, well, we have to do this whole thing again. You need to infiltrate Drake's Island and I didn't realize it would do that much damage, but okay. Stay clear of patrols. Yeah, I think it's still going to be um, focused. Like, the, the levels are still going to be focused in terms of their design, but... I, f I almost feel like they're going to do, they're almost going to be a mix of driving like you're seeing at least an agent under fire in this, along with the shooting, but if it gets to that point, I'll, I'll open up comms, but for now, I think I should be okay. I have all of you here with me, and I'm... And wanting nostalgia. Better keep your distance, James. Those mines look nasty. At least I know what these mines, they're on a path. Skip to Roger Moore. Well, it also depends on who this, what this bond is gonna look like, right? It's gonna be a hipster. Hipster Studios is that what we're gonna call it? The new, a new James Bond game by Hipster Studios. You heard it here first, people. Make Adam Driver Bond, really? Oh, that'd be kind of funny. I wonder how that would fly with people. People would not be happy about that. Now I'm doing much worse than before. Is he British? Or European? Adam should be the new Q. 
Actually, no, no. You can put Adam Driver into James Bond. You can put him into Bond. It's just he would have to be... You could make him a villain. Just out of spy school. Training to be Bond, right? Well, I mean, no, if they put Taylor Swift, you know she's going to write a song about it. There we go. Taylor Swift for Bond theme song. I don't know. There's never valet parking when you Fidel could do it. another one. You know, <laughs> okay, this is gonna sound dumb or completely off tone. I want a metal James Bond song. I want a heavy one. I would want it to be heavy. Let Lizzie Hale from Hailstrom do a Bond theme. There you go. John, you read <laughs> We have to have her boyfriend in the movie anyway. She has to do the song. Mm -hmm. Finally finish the mission. It just took a while. So that was maybe the hardest mission I've had to do in the game so far. Am I missing something? Restart the mission. We didn't get far, so that's not a big deal. This time we're gonna go this way. I wonder if that makes a difference. Are you serious? I needed to go the other direction? Now let's leave.
Yeah, yeah, I know. I know. We're just gonna shoot things, okay? Open the door. No, restart. Download the codes and then go back and then blow that up. Is it just me or does the driving feel really loose? Don't know how I did that, but okay. Downloading access code. Code Come on. There we go. Come on, open. Transmitting access code. Code accepted. Come on. Well, they didn't make it. That compound should contain a transmission dish with direct access to Drake's computer network. Okay, never mind. Well, okay, that worked. I guess that's an idea, right? I'm pretty sure someone thought of that idea just to drive in casually. Right? Transmitting access code. Code accepted. What's wrong with my stuff? Like, is it in this channel or in all of them in general?
for it, Jeep. Like, how so? Every channel. For some, I guess it might depend on permissions. Fuck you. Yeah, because that worked. Unless they have special permissions that you need to have in order to use it there. Didn't Billie Eilish do a song, I think, for James Bond? Yeah, I played that PC version as well. And apparently that PC and that PC version apparently is very bad. I don't remember much of it. I almost want to try and get it again and compare. But I will say like I am enjoying this game despite those frustrations I've had with some levels. But damn. Well, yeah, because it's not the exact same as the console. Transmitting access they changed. They had to change things for it. I know still some people still play that multiplayer. The experience level. So, like, default difficulty. Default difficulty isn't too hard, then, right? Three times, you get a focus kill three times, that auto aims that insta kill is the same. Focus kills are so much fun. Before I go online with it. That P well, I know with the PC version of Nightfire, I know like it's you can get it to work. Just wondering how difficult it is. Work, 
so far, 007. But there are still several more sand towers along this canyon. You'll have to destroy them before our forces can infiltrate the island. Oh, I only have one HP. That's a problem. Okay, so, so far it's working for you on this end. It might have just something to do with how maybe the bot's set up. Is what I'm guessing. But it's working for you, Jeep. It's weird that it isn't working in, say, Vincent Cassie's, like you said, right? Because is it just happening for you or is it happening for everybody? Any Aston Martin, honestly. Okay, so it restores health, which is nice. Or, here's a better one. If we want to go with Bond vehicles. Anyone that he doesn't destroy... Yeah, I forgot they made one for Rocket League. So the BMW's at three. I mean, that's one of them. Didn't he have an M5 at one point? Jack Wade drives off in it, really?
That plane takes a lot. The DBS? Oh, the DB5. There was an Aston Martin DB5. Wasn't the one in... Wasn't there also a B12 Vanquish, I think, in one of them, too? Correct me if I'm wrong on that. You gotta be shitting me. Okay. Hang on. We're going down. Yeah, the Vankers wasn't dying another day. Okay. That's what I thought. Okay, I thought I had to shoot that thing. I promise a softer landing next time. I'm counting on it, Allura. Come on. I'll hold them off, Allura. You find a way to disable this contraption. Of course. Oh, okay, at least it doesn't take me back far. You find a way to disable this contraption. At least it doesn't make us restart the whole level. Lotus and the Spy Who Loved Me. I haven't seen that one. But there's a Lotus. A Lotus is still cool. Alright, now we're going to space. Why do I have the feeling we're about to split up again? 
This shaft's drawing air. I have a good idea why. Inform MI6 yeah. of our location. Spy who loved me. Was that Sean Connery or was that Roger Moore? Though for that one, Glenn. Yay, another another stealth mission, okay. Roger Moore, okay. Bond may have penetrated our security. Lock down the sector at once and deactivate all access codes but my own. Right away, Mr. Ashi. I'm going to do a full sweep of this facility. Remain at your post and stay alert. Understood, Mr. Ashi. Alright, yep, we're gonna have to take I've her down. I've to the terminal and got access to their internal systems. A lot of it has been locked out, but I can access the security cameras. Nico is our only option. She's locked out all of the clearances. You'll need to find her and stay close. Okay, nothing. Double O seven difficulty. Well, that could be a challenge. Kiko is currently in corridor A eight.
Oh, no, this way, not this way. I'm gonna go to sleep. Okay, go get some sleep, Glenn. Thank you for hanging out with us, buddy, though, and talking some James Bond. We'll hopefully do more of it soon as the play th as the series continues, Nico right? A12 now. Could just shoot everything. I vote violence. Well, violence is coming. And Violet's got me.
Echo is currently in corridor A8. We have an intruder. There we go. We're slowly making progress, right? At least this one went better than the last time. Than the last one I saw you play. Yeah, like, Agent Under Fire did have a few moments, but no. It seems like with Night Fire, they stepped it up. Which, you know what? That's fine. Like, that's what you would expect. Like, when you get a new installment, you expect it to be a little more difficult. Right? Yeah, just sit there and take it. worked his way into the complex the elite guards better than before at least for savage definitely below to cut the power so he can't follow but if bond does reach the facility i'll be sure to thank him for the makeover he gave me
Come on. Also, they don't really seem to give you a lot of ammo. Junester, thank you so much for that follow. I appreciate that. You are now McVon. Welcome to the club. Glad to have you here, and I hope you enjoy your stay. How are you doing tonight? Played Baldur's Gate, made a thief, stole the health potion in the beginning area, got caught, and died to a guard I didn't save. GG. Well, you did well, but you could do better. You could do more, right? That's just unfortunate. This one's gonna be a tough one too. But then again, these last few missions. James, I've hacked into the terminal and got access to their internal systems. A lot of it has been locked out, but I can access the security cameras. Kiko is our only option. She's locked out all other clearances. You'll need to find her and stay close. So you can't do that. Or you can, it's just like I'm not doing it right. There we go. But go go rest up, Hawk. Thank you for hanging out with us, buddy. I'll talk with you soon, okay?
like Kiko is nearly at the control center. Hurry up. James, see if you can find some way to disrupt the base's security system. Let's try this again. Open the door. We need to get through that door to Delta Center. Hurry, James. Target acquired in Alpha Sector. We have an intruder. We're just playing a little softball. Here, catch this uh, grenade that I'm gonna throw at your way, right? I mean, what else would we be throwing? Although I do wish this game did have mid, mid-level checkpoints or something. When you load a new area, it seems to do that sometimes. Yeah. To me, that gun looks like the OICW. If anyone remembers that, the Objective Infantry Combat Weapon. They call it the Ames 920. Because there was this gun also in Soldier of Fortune 2, I believe.
Damn it. I blew myself up. You could say that. Let the rage flow, basically. James, I've hacked into the terminal and got access to their internal systems. A lot of it has been locked out, but I can access the security cameras. Kiko is our only option. She's locked out all of the clearances. You'll need to find her and stay close. Okay, so that's that one. Let's try this again. Kiko is in corridor A12 now. Control center. Hurry up. Take doors open. There we go.
Did we not have company this time? You'll need to get through that door to Delta Sector. Hurry, James. We'll do it in a minute. I need to grab some stuff. Yeah, because now they're just not the game's just not gonna play nice anymore. All right, what are the chances of success here?
There we go. That's at least that section done. So that's one part of this level done. Nice, thanks, Jeep. Come on. Have a great rest of your night, buddy. Thanks, dude. Thanks for hanging out with us, Siege. Take care of yourself, okay? I will see you soon. That's what I was afraid of. Let's see how far back if it just kicks us back to the start of this level. Yep, okay, good. There we go. I think that was a vent. Nope. Come on. Yep. Nope, decryptor. Decrypt this for me. Yeah, that was worth it for full armor. Going for bulletproof. Go, go, go. Come on. No, I don't like the look of that. Yep, I knew that was going to happen. Why does it have to be what I, you think it's going to be?
Okay, well, there's stuff in here, so I'll take that. Let's see. Oh, that's some bullshit right there. Wrong button. That's death. Oh, I need that. Come on. Come on, go this way. Oh, no. That's our exit. That's it for this section. My loyal associates, before we cross into the void of space, it's time to unveil the final stages of Operation Nightfire. The other transformation of the planet you'll soon view from your shuttle windows. The communist, socialists, and fascists were predestined to fail in their efforts at globalization. The answer is sublimely simple. A corporate takeover by Phoenix International on a worldwide scale. No more national boundaries, but continent-wide regions of agriculture, industry, energy production, and research. Quarreling governments are replaced with a single board of directors. Of course, a new order will be resisted. But we have the ultimate leverage. The nuclear missiles mounted in our iron blockers and controlled from an unassailable command center. The U.S. Space Defense Platform. Unfortunately, our security has been temporarily breached. Therefore, I've advanced our launch schedule. All flight crews and combat units are to board their shuttles at once and prepare for liftoff. Operation Nightfire has begun. And Operation Nightfire is going to be stopped.
Ah, oh, flashbangs. Well, this is a problem. One rocket's off. Take him down. It's hopeless, James. How does it feel to be beaten, James? Come on. Okay, so no matter what, it's just gonna be blinding light. But I guess that makes sense. Yeah, I don't think you're going anywhere. You did this to me, I do it to you. You could say for her she got lit. James, I'm still patched into Drake's comm system. I've intercepted enough radio chatter to learn that Drake's combat troops have overtaken the defense platform. Some of the original crew might still be alive, but I can't confirm that. I can tell you that Drake's deployed a laser defense net which draws power from the platform's core. Rather enjoyed your company, James. Do be careful. Call out. All right. All right, Jeep. What do you think's gonna happen? One fool's errand, Mr. Bond. I've just locked the launch sequence. Nothing can stop Operation Nightfire. Not even my own death. That's a theory I mean to test. <laughs> You've already failed miserably. But tinker with my missiles if you must. It'll make a splash. 
under target for my laser cannons. James, the missiles. You won't be able to disarm the warheads in time. Your only hope is to sabotage the launch system in some way. You'll have to disable them manually. Each launch gantry has a weak coupling that you can melt with your laser. Okay. I'll credit you with persistence, Mr. Bond. Persistence and failure. There are NATO launch sites on Earth which could challenge the arsenal on my island. Those bases will be incinerated by turning these defensive missiles into massively offensive ones. I've kept my most hardened combat veterans on reserve, Bond. I'll let them finish you off. Let's retry this again. Zero grav is tough. Thank you. 
will you? Like that. Damn it. It's gonna make me do all that again, yep. Yeah. I thought I got it. I guess not. James. You continue 
I don't have much health, so we're gonna have to make do. There we go. You may have stopped the fire this time, Bond. But like the Phoenix, I'll rise from the ashes. The missiles are damaging the station. It's starting to break up. James, you must hurry. The laser has gone into overload, James. Drake's lost control of it. It could blow any second. All right, let's try this again. Now that we made it that far, right? Wait. Oh, okay. You're like, oh, he flew into that thing. <laughs> Done. There we go. Let's get the hell out of here. Hey, Zolo, dude. Thank you for that raid of you eight lovely peeps. Let me just give you a shout out. How was your stream? How was Terraria? Raiders, welcome. Shaken. We're actually just wrapping up. We just finished up Nightfire. Stirred, not shaken. Hmm. Either one. Don't I'm still you... upset Dominique is dead. Stirred. Astronomers from around the globe are reporting unexpected meteor showers. It's well, going well, fam. How was Terraria? Oh, I'm sure. We'll let the autopilot be our designated driver. All right, where are you taking us? Oh, James. Ah, oh, jeez. Played for like 12 hours. Nice. I'm assuming it was your day off then. But yeah, no, we let the bo lull the Bond move, yeah. Twenty months, the team at EA Games developed James Bond 007 Nightfire. Three core international teams in the United States, England, and Canada. Programmers, writers, artists. God returns to see where it belongs with people in it, so they can just go wherever they want, right? Have you played any of the James Bond games, though, Zolo? Brings the Bond film star into the hands of game players. We see Chris Brosnan in the game. We see Chris Brosnan. See so, yeah, no, I guess we're just doing behind-the-scenes stuff now with it. So. He brings a certain authenticity and personality to the character, just like he does in the film. Mm-hmm. So when you see him wink or raise his eyebrow, you've definitely seen the real McCoy. Fast cars are another that's part of the experience, especially with stuff like that, right? The Vanquish, also featured in this year's Bond film, Die Another Day, mm -hmm. sports a six-liter V12 engine with a Formula One-style transmission. It can go from zero to 60 <laughs> You gotta love it from that era. ...speeds in excess of 190 miles per hour. To bring this amazing vehicle into the game, the design team at EA worked with Aston Martin but yeah, no, what were you doing in Terraria? I returned. I edited 66 photos. <laughs> it's quite a few photos, though, Leifer. Well, we just finished... We just finished Nightfire, so... This is kind of the behind-the-scenes thing. I'm 
How much more left do you have, Leafer? But yeah, okay. O2 is when this game came out. So this is this is apparently 20 years old. But yeah. There you go. We are done with this game. Is it in the hundreds, you would say, Leafer? But yeah. That's two out of four now. So that means next week we move on to everything or nothing. Then once everything or nothing is done, we go to From Russia With Love. You know what? Maybe. Maybe we'll do, I'll do a bonus one afterwards. I'm gonna decide on that. So we'll give that, we'll give that a, I'll give that a thought and see what's up with it. But we'll see. But hopefully you guys are enjoying, you know, the runs for James Bond, whether it's your first time seeing it or, you know, you've played it before. So hopefully I'm not destroying your nostalgia for these. The food prep for tomorrow. Yeah, no, I will go to sleep shortly though, Zolo, but thank you for that raid. I appreciate you, my friend. You have a good one as well. It's good to see you. But you know, we're going through them at a relatively good click, I would say. Thanks for that, Leafer. We'll give him another shout out. But yeah, so yeah, because I have the other t the other ones over there ready to go. So I think we should be fine for next week. Like I'm hopefully gonna get it ready for Monday. If not, it's gonna be Tuesday again. But as it says, James Bond will return, and we won't have to wait long for that. But yeah, we are done with this. So. That was, that was basically 007 Nightfire. Again, I hope you guys enjoyed it. I cannot wait to see where we continue on with the James Bond stuff. Let's go see who is. I know just the person. Just need to make sure they are not on a BRB screen. But yeah. Next up, agent, uh, no, ex next up for our agent, Mr. James Bond. It's everything or nothing. And that one I'm actually excited to see. But yeah. So let's go raid this man. He is currently live and he is not on a BRB back, so we're good with that. But yeah, everybody, thank you all for coming by. If you missed out, I do keep Twitter updated, and if you did miss out at least on this, I will upload the playthrough to YouTube so you can catch up there. But again, everybody, thank you for everything. It means a lot. And until next time, I will see all of you in the next stream.